Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you my top five face masks. So if you wanna know my top five face masks, then keep on watching. And as you can see, I'm not wearing like a lot of makeup because I really wanted my skin to like heal a little bit, like breathe a little bit. So yeah. So the first one is this one. This is the L'Oreal's Pure Clay Mask, and this is their Detoxifying Mask. This is what it looks like and it's like almost over like this is almost over it's a really amazing uh, face mask it's recommended for like pretty much all skin types it takes off everything off of your skin so this is a really great mask so the second one is this one this is the plum green tea's clear face mask and plum is all natural this is vegan and this is not tested on animals so yeah so this is all natural and this face mask is paraben free and i think the l'oreal one is also paraben free and this is how the mask looks like it's not really thick it's a thin mask but it's really good if you have oily skin or combination skin it it has that tingling sensation to it if you know what i mean and it also cleans up the skin really nicely i've only used it three times but it's really amazing i actually used it today as well and i love it so the next step is this one this is the himalayas purifying neem pack and it says it's herbal but it has parabens in it yes it says it's herbal but it has parabens in it so yeah but i really like this mask it's a really great mask it has like the gritty particles like grittiness to it so it also scrubs your face as well when you wash it i do not use this like twice or thrice a week but i definitely use this like once a week or twice a week i really love it but i do not use this often because it has parabens so this face mask is suitable for combination to oily skin so yeah like dry skin people can also use this but you have to really like apply like a heavy moisturizer after using this so yeah so the next up is this one this is the Kali's herbal face pack and this is also neem face pack and the only thing I hate about it is the packaging it comes in a plastic bag like this it's almost over as you can see there is only one use left and you can use this with like any sort of water but there is only thing that annoys me but other than that this face mask is amazing and Kali is all natural this is for pretty much all skin type if you have really really dry skin then this might be drying on you so apply a heavy moisturizer after that so next up is again from Kali, this is their Multani Mitti and it also comes in a like pouch like this, like plastic pouch. Same thing with this one, you also have to like mix it in with water or something. There's only like 5-6 uses left, so yeah. There's only one thing that I don't like about this uh, face pack that it takes ages to dry, like legit. And it is suitable for combination to oily skin dry skin people stay away from this it's drying but it's really amazing for combination skin people and oily skin people i know i've only covered like face masks for combination to oily skin but i have combination skin so i have to use those face masks that works for me so these are my recommendations and if you have dry skin then Plum has a white tea, moisture, a white tea face mask then you can definitely try that one. So yeah that's it. These are my top 5 face masks. Pretty much every mask is under 500 rupees except this one. This is for like 700 rupees or something but you can definitely get this one in the sale so so yeah that's it and these are my top 5 face masks i hope you like this video and if you did don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel and i will see you all in my next video bye